Ladies and gentlemen, in our main event of the evening, BKB presents seven two-minute rounds of bare-knuckle boxing in this world flyweight title clash. Introducing first, in the blue corner, representing Scotland but fighting out of Wales, with a BKB record of six wins and four defeats, Tony the Tiger Lafferty! Across the ring, his opponent stands in the red corner, representing Leeds with a BKB record of 10 wins and three defeats, Scott the Mute McHugh! Clive Allenton is our referee in charge of the action. Shooting, shooting. Okay, lads, both know the rules, all right? Watch your heads coming in, watch the strikes to the back of the head. If you're in clues, expect you to work at all times. All strikes above there, no holding the striking, all right? Good luck to both of you. Let's go. Interesting. For the final City, time tonight, Sean, let's get down George, to business. Jurassic, Hall of Famer for BKB. Scott McHugh you beat him. Yep. Right? That's how tough this is. And uh, look at Lafferty, he's smiling. I love it. Both of them smiling. Let's see what Lafferty turns up Interesting, today. Interesting, Scott McHugh punched himself in the face twice to get himself ready. I'd have done that for free. <laughs> <laughs> see, already see the improvement. The there movement. you go, that's what I was just about to say, Tom. You can see straight already, you know, Lafferty's on the back foot. They're he, both improved, yeah. though, as fighters. He used to be straight in, didn't he, having a tear up. Yeah. Look, he's using he's, he's thinking more now. On seven rounds, you can take a round. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly, Tom. It's a long way, you know. Yeah. Both yeah. right on their feet. Both just know what's going on. Yep, both looking really mobile. Waiting for that opportunity. Working off the jab. Yeah. Lafferty, you've fallen a little bit short, but he's trying it, tried it again, so did Squick you. I think the Q had a bit more success with his. Oh, he's trying to go with him into oh, trying to make him Come make on, he's trying to bring him forward to yeah. punch him. Never stuff from Lafferty there. Oh. Just a nice, nice head movement from Lafferty. Good, good yeah. He's been working with he's some been, good yeah. people in Wales. Yeah, and you can way. see it, time. It's nice to see, you know. I mean, we'd all like this, that old style of his, you know, get stuck in, but. Yeah, but that's okay to a level. Yeah. Doing a world yeah. champ. Yeah, exactly. And he, you know, he, that, uh, he, he's got boxing skills and he's using them now, and it's nice to see. There we go. Right hand, double left up. Nicely you know what I was just him. thinking? McHugh hasn't thrown a, thrown a shot yet. Yeah. I thought yeah. I was thinking that at that moment. He, timed it Boom. he let that straight right uh, loose himself. <coughs> but that's what matters. Yep. It's a 10 8 round for him. But Lafferty will be confident still yeah. because he'll yeah, think he's not, he, I was yeah. the boss of that round. Yeah, he bossed that round right up until the last 10 seconds. He bossed that round. Then there he comes again. Beautiful. Oh. And then the head movement afterwards. McHugh is so dangerous yeah. with them short. He's, McHugh is such a, a talented. You yeah. look at his, his posture, yeah. look at his, his elbows yeah. tight, look at his hooks. He's moving, ready yeah. to block the shot. Always ready. And, and McHugh tried the hook, maybe behind the jab, but he should have. But he tried the hook, he tried it. out the way. Yeah. Gets their hands up tight, I've noticed McHugh. As soon as he gets in close, their hands up come up tight. They're both very fit as well. Yeah. They, dancing and you know lots of movement which I love to see by the way I'm not well. wasting shots not wasting many shots especially McHugh he's you know he's I love the way his elbows his, his punches McHugh come from quite close yeah. Lafferty still plenty of spring in them uh, Steps of his. Ten seconds of this round remaining. Yeah, that's what I like, Tom. That the head movement as he's going. Even though he's got his hands low, he's moving that head as he as yeah. he 
And when he does as it, he when McGill, the also, when McGill does that, he tries to hit the body as, he, as his head comes. Clever boxers. Good shot oh, good from shot McGill. From again. Picked him well. <laughs> you know, when somebody does that, I think that's what you did. Yeah, them. it's usually to tell you you hurt them. Yeah. There's a 10 second sound. Good jab, good jabs from both fighters then. Both look at them dancing, they can't wait to get it underway. See, movement again. Anything now, any sort of movement, the head, the shoulders, the fluid. You all can't say the word fluidity. He's telling me about his fingers as he puts his hand out, yeah. You've got to close your fingers. Oh, good shot from McHugh. Just caught Rafferty, sorry, Lafferty on the way in with that left hook. He's tough, Lafferty, durable, comes straight back. <laughs> He's telling him to hit me, but he did. He's telling me again. <laughs> Two good guys, good good friends, and it's like when you hit them, they laugh at each other. I love it. Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. He's, he's corner saying thank you. He's corner telling think, think. He's apologising. He, he said he wanted a point take that I'm not think. say probably for me Scott McHugh is, is, is a veteran now he might be the most improved fighter yeah. at BKP in terms of technique yeah boxing well both fighters boxing well oh good shot close round this one nicely picked right hand there from uh, right jam as well <laughs> Lafferty making him miss him he's a crowd pleaser yeah. Lafferty but he's giving him the tongue <laughs> and again he's another fighter that's improved yeah so improved yeah one of the most improved I think yeah. in the BKB scene I mean, we like this other style to get stuck in, you know, trading. But this is good to see as well, Tom. You he's know, boxing very yeah, well. He's boxing very well, it's just. Remember that Scott McHugh was British champion, gave it up, he said, I've, I've had enough, I've defended it twice, now I want to fight for a world title, I want a world belt. Good job from McHugh. really focused McHugh as well as he's got both the high guard as well look how he's got that high guard Tom head movement beautiful and he, nice the, jab the shots are crisp aren't they yeah nice snappy shot yeah snappy that's yeah. the word I was looking for that's why I say Tom not a lot of shots being wasted by either of the fighters to be honest picking the shots well Almost what you would call an intriguing fight because you know what I mean. Both of them have got so much to offer. Yeah, it's a and clever despite, fight. Good despite, technical fight. Despite Scott being well ahead, you wouldn't bet against anything, would you? No. I mean, laughs is he's boxing well himself, isn't he? Tommy? Yeah. He's just he's getting, you know, he got caught then. Two sharp boxers now, looking for an opening. Yeah. Oh, good shot. Yeah, good shot, well picked from McHugh. McHugh again. Just at the top of uh, Lafferty's head. Temple. I think Lafferty knows already that he's got a bit to do. Nice yeah. shot from Lafferty, well picked. I mean, you'd know. Do you know in a fight whether you... 15 punches landed against 10. I mean, so well ahead. And all three judges went red then. But Lafferty will know now that he's got to pull something out the bag. Yeah, he's got to, he's got to step it up now. Maybe he has to and go back know, to the old... You Lafferty. know the crazy thing? Lafferty's fought so well in... Yeah, he's boxed well. In another situation, yeah, he might he win the fight, yeah. in this performance. 
And it's a shame in fights like this, there's got to be a loser in the top. Yeah, for sure. Because he's in the fight, I mean, you know, he's... Scott looks as determined as I've seen him. Well, he's not on <laughs> the, referee on the blind side yeah. of the referee, but... <laughs> You get away with what you can get away with, Tom. Fair play to it. <laughs> yeah, holding Clyde doing a wonderful job there, keeping them apart. Let the fight go on, and both still light on their feet, yeah. aren't they? Did a bouncing Lafferty's uh, spring in his step there, still bouncing around the ring. More than one punch, combination. I mean, maybe now we need to see a bit of the old Lafferty, you know. Now he would need to turn. Yeah, he needs a bit of a turn, or he needs a, you know, we don't but want to take too many punches. When he does get him close, he's got a few closes him yeah. up, and, and that's frustrating, yeah. Tony Lafferty. It's a good jab from the cue there, just as Lafferty you know, tried the right hand, just missed. Oh, good shot, right on the button. You're right, though. Sometimes you see two guys giving it all and it's a shame someone's got to lose. <laughs> I don't think anybody could argue with that. Oh, not with the score. No, no, I'm just saying it's a shame. Scott McHugh was yeah. being... I just mean Lafferty, you know, he's boxing well. And like we, like you said, Tom, you know, maybe in another fight on another day. Well, here we go. And straight away, still both dancing and bobbing and weaving. Be interesting to see. You need your corner to be right there, don't you? You need your yeah, corner to be where you need your corner. Give you the you information. The, yeah, you need them banging on the car. I know that, you know, just keep shouting them instructions, Tom. I've heard before corners telling Joshua as well. You're doing well, you're doing well. You're doing well you're doing, it wasn't, yeah. No, I think always tell the truth. Tell the truth. I always tell the truth. You know, if you know your fight has lost that, you tell him he's lost that. Tell him. Yeah, it's the way you tell them, you don't pay what my lord, you've lost yeah. that. This is what nice you've got to do. Calm, nice and calm and collect. Still going left and he's moving. And, and significant, right? And there's not many marks and cuts, is there? No. But they're both yeah. excellent yeah. defensively. Picking them shots nice, the landing. Never takes his eyes off his opponent. Never blinks. Just Lafferty is nice desperate. Nice. Nice. Just falls short with that left hook. Tony's just waiting for that gap. Still isn't moving, no. Yeah, still, still moving, bobbing and weaving. Yeah. Just waiting for that Ooh, gap. Good shot. Oh, good shot from McHugh again. He's matured into a, a good fighter, hasn't he? Yep. McHugh. Yep. He was always brave, always yep. courageous. The boxing well, he's just now brain. he's developed into a yeah. very good boxer. Yeah. You know, he's worked on his tactics for this fight. You can see what he's, you know, he's keeping that guy. Watch every time Lafferty gets close, the hands come up straight away. He knows Lafferty's dangerous inside. There's another good round. That shows you what he's putting into it. Yeah. It's the movement, Tom, it's that constant it's footwork, that head McHugh's movement. just said, come and fight, come and fight. That's why Lafferty, <laughs> he may need to now, Tom, he needs to. He, maybe he needs to go back yeah, but, to that but old Lafferty. If the corner have done the job for McHugh, they should be telling him, you don't need to do anything. Yeah, you know, just stay on, stay, your feet, foot, yeah. stay on your back foot, pop the jab out, keep him away. He needs to bring the fight to you, you don't need to take the fight to him. I have to say, Lafferty's techniques include yeah. and his, his movement. And that was a nicely picked right hand, actually, from Lafferty then. And he's still not, even though we, we, we'd like him to, to, just to end this round with a... The old lap, he's still sticking to that boxing, and it's nice to see in a way. You know, it's not all gone out the window. Super fight. Yeah. Oh, bit of rough and tumble on the inside there. Oh, nicely picked up the cut from Lapis. He does have a shot. Bit of a cut under the right yeah. eye, and he's covering it now. McHugh, McHugh cut under the right eye. He's got that little uppercut, I thought, yep. in Lapis' throw. He'll be glad that's yeah. in this round yeah. and not in the third. 
Oh, there's another good shot from Lafferty. And another good shot and a nice combo from Lafferty. Oh, oh walked God. onto his right hand, though. No. <laughs> Both. And the corners are doing the right thing there. He's like, he needs to put the pressure on now. Because he hurt. Yeah, he hurt me. I mean, I don't think he's gone, gone, but he's hurt him. He he's, he's struggling to that see that eye. eye. Now's the time for Lafferty to put the pressure on and unload Tom. You know, this pick it down a good shot from uh, McHugh. Timed it well, just as Lafferty. That counter punch there is excellent, isn't yeah. it? Just reminds Lafferty hang on here. Yeah. I'm still here. I'm still dangerous. I'm still dangerous, I'm still here. <laughs> Ten seconds. Wow, what a fight. fight. What a fight, two wonderful, wonderful warriors. Ladies and gentlemen, after seven epic rounds, I think both of these warriors deserve a huge round of applause. Wow. In our main event and final fight of the evening, the BKB World Flyweight title clash, we have the judges' decisions. It is a unanimous decision. To the red corner, Scott McHugh! Ray Wayne Scott and the new world champion. Yeah, talk us a bit, we haven't got long, so can you talk us through that fight? Was it a tough fight? Yeah, it was tough, man. Fuck me. Well done, Tony. I told you I'd get me revenge. We trained hard. I lost her. Jam. You're all absolute legends, thank you, man. If it weren't for them, boys. Yeah, and you, you know, you look like you, you, you worked out on your tactics, obviously a world title fight. You worked out for your tactics for that fight. Yeah, yeah. You stuck to your tactics, yeah? And that's what's seeing you through. Great knockdown. Yeah, great knockdown, do you know, at the same you, time. You took a punch as well, just as you landed your... Yeah, I didn't even know I knocked him down. I thought I'd knock myself down, to be honest. <laughs> but, yeah. but yeah, I'm... I'm you know, we had the game plan there, I knew. I'm too strong, I'm too good. There's no one beating me in BKB now, man. That was a great, you know, a great... I lost this gym, best fucking gym in England, man. Everyone for you boys, Lee, everyone, Andy, Jade, my wife. Yeah, I'm just... I mean, I don't want to spoil you with your world title win there, but what are we looking to, what are we looking to do next? Are we going to defend it? Are we going to challenge at different weights? Um, yeah, I'll go up. I don't know. We'll see, we'll see. You're going to celebrate being your world champion at the moment. Our third place here, pal. Great win. We look forward to seeing you out again soon. Any names to throw in the mix before we go? Any man, anywhere, Mush. Hey, uh, do you know what? It's been a while. It's been a while, you know. I ain't had a drink in a bit, so. You know how we do when we've had a few and a point two. You this where you. You're back, Shadrach. But well, you deserve a drink tonight after that win. Uh, well, congratulations, Scott, on becoming world champion again. All the very best, pal. Look forward to seeing you again soon. Look forward to seeing you all, but I can't see fuck all once again, Mush. Woo! Bring up. <laughs>